Hello! Hi, this is Nikki Sunshine Creates, and I'm Nikki. I've got an unboxing for you. And if I remember, because it's been a while, I believe this is my latest penny from Uniquely Yours Down Under. I may be wrong. I don't know. That these gray packages, they never tell you who it's from. I think it's because... I think Customs puts a new la label on them, and it puts it right over. Well, let's find out together what we have here. Oh, um, we have a box! Yes! <laughs> oh, God! Good morning to everybody. Yeah, it's morning here. If, you're, uh, if you enjoy yourself today, uh, I hope you will. And you're not a subscriber, please subscribe and hit that bell so that you're always notified when I let upload a video or go live. Let's see. Jeez, let's pick a pick a side. Okay, we'll pick a side. Oh. This oh, oh, this is Treasure Studios Art. That's right. They said they would send me, ah, uh, Rachel is sending me, ooh, a replacement uh, diamond painting because the last one I got from her, I had so much trouble with the drills that I, I, I couldn't even get finished. I didn't, I said, you don't have to, but apparently she did. Let's see what she sent me. She sent me... Wildflowers. Ooh, that was on my wish list. <laughs> I did say to her, if you want to, you know, she asked me what I wanted. And I said, you don't have to. And she said, what do you want? And I said, pick, you know, pick something from my, my wish list. I, you know, it doesn't matter to me. I'm, I'm fine, you know. But, you know, it happens. Mistakes happen. I know that. It was very frustrating at the time. But let's see what we got here. I love these boxes. I have to say, these boxes are nice. And this came in that sturdier white box, so you know you're not going to get a damaged painting. Come on, come on. It's just temporarily. Ow! Ooh, I did something to my left shoulder. Slept on it wrong or something, and now I'm in hell. <laughs> It does hurt. So I'm trying not to use it. Oh, more crackling. Sorry about that. You don't need it, so it goes in the garbage. Okay. Oh, no tape. We have a little toolkit here. Ooh, uh, pink rounded tweezers. Uh... Let's see, we got a diamond painting pen, a white tray with a funnel, a three-placer, looks like a five-placer, and a straightener. This is nice. Oh, and a squishy, and a nice, nice big chunk of wax. So, that's good. Let's see, this painting is 60 by 50. Perfect size. Not like the ones I've been doing, which are like humongous. <laughs> All right, because it is poured glue, you can turn it. I'm doing this voiceover because I made a mistake. Treasure Studios Arts does not have poured glue. They have mounted glue, which should have been, I should have handled it differently. You don't roll it <laughs> at all. <laughs> Instead... Lay it out where you can. Take each corner, pull it back, just you know a little bit. Then, 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 put the the plastic back on it. It should flatten out. Do that with all four corners. That should help make it lay flat. But don't do what I just did. <laughs> don't roll it. <laughs> that was a mistake. Well, let's take a look at this. This is... 
This is pretty. That's a lot of freaking graffiti, uh, confetti. So there's some color blocking here. But, and, you know, the flowers. This is really pretty. Very abstract, very a uh, Monet like, I have to say. Oh, wait, this is the. <laughs> That's the top. This is the bottom. There we go. That makes a little bit more sense. That's a very pretty. Isn't that pretty? Let's see. Uh, yeah. Isn't that pretty? I like that. Hey, how come we're cooking? There we go. This is nice. I like this. There are 35 colors. Uh, I don't think there are any ABs in here. But I have ABs. I can bling it up a little. You know, like the heart. What is the heart? Is 817. That's the little highlighting hearts. Might bling that up a little bit. It's a red. Well, let's take a look at the colors. This is really nice. You can you can always tell a canvas is good by looking at the back. If there are no serious wrinkles or you know rivers in the back, then you have no problem. Because if there are serious you know wrinkles in this, they, these are not minor. Uh, It'll be hard to place your drills on, you know, because well, they're flat. The wrinkles, crinkles, whatever you want to call them, on top, that's nothing. That's just the, uh, the, the, um, plastic cover. Now, I must say that Church Studios Art has sticky canvas. That they do have. So when you're putting down your drills, try and put them down in in, in the just the right place, rather, rather than having to move them around. But shall we take a look? Yes. <laughs> Hang on. Uh, I'll be right back with the ca with the camera a little bit lower, so we can see what we're what what we got. Be right back. And we're back. Okay, let's take a look at these. This is in that pretty picture. Let's take a look at it without the plastic. Ooh, I forgot. They're individually baggied. Oh, isn't that nice? Do I want to take them out? <laughs> Do I really want to take them out? Because it's so hard to get them back in. It really is. <laughs> uh, let's take a look at that. Oh, gosh. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? <gasps> very, very Monet-esque. Yeah, it's... It's definitely, this is definitely been, it has a Monet influence. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Really pretty. Oh, we got a nice, it's, these are round drills. Yeah, I prefer square, but then it was the square I had issues with, so I think that's why she sent me around. <laughs> and a uh, look at these colors. Let me turn a light on over here. See if you can see any. Oh. Look at these colors. They are gorgeous. Okay, let's see what we have. 300. Really nice. Nice brown. 307. Pretty yellow. It's a lot. It's a little bit brighter than the camera shows. I don't know why the camera shows colors differently, but I'll let you know when they do. Uh, three, 
36. This is a very nice navy blue. It's it's not as dark. Can you? It's hard to see with the reflection of the lights, but then without the light, you can't see it. So, damned if you do, damned if you don't. 336. 413, a nice gray. 445, a buttery, little br a bright buttery yellow. It's not that buttery. Hey, ha 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 ha. 553. Pretty lavender. We like lavender. Yeah, we do. <laughs> uh, 301. Very nice. Uh, what do you call this? Call it terracotta? Russ? Brown? I don't know. I, I have no, I don't know the names for colors. I mean, I know there are. Here's a nice medium turquoise. Not too deep, not, not too light. You know, there's two different colors of turquoise. There's blue and green. It's also green with, usually has a little bit of brown veining through it. Really nice. Six, six, six. Bright red. Now, I may change these out for uh, ABs if I have them. I don't know. I have. I don't have a lot of round ABs because I don't work a lot of round veinings. Uh, 726, 823, 891, no, 894, 900, 3325, I like this blue, that's pretty, 829, 905, very grassy green. 996, another pretty blue, a little darker, deeper. 3340, isn't that pretty? Oh, wait, we, we missed a 936, which is a really nice hunter green. And a 921, let's keep these in order. So it's 921 and then 936. Very nice. Very nice. And then the 996. And now we can go to. Oh, okay. here's another one missing. 833. That's a real. That's a good spicy brown mustard. That's great coupon. <laughs> <laughs> that really is a great coupon. I want this. This is eight thirty-three. I want to put them in order. Just make, I'm just anal that one. Look nice, egg. Uh, thirty-three forty. Thirty-three seventy-one. This is a very dark brown. This is the darkest chocolate you can find. Yum. Yum yum. Thirty six oh eight. What a pretty lavender pink. And that pretty. I oh, that's pretty. Yeah. Thirty six oh nine. A lighter lavenderish pink. I love pink. Who doesn't love pink? Third. Well, guys might not love pink. I love pink. My bestie loves pink. Thirty seven forty three. I'm trying to make this as entertaining as possible because going through numbers, you know, colors is, eh, I don't know, some people like it, some people don't. I'm one of those that can take it or leave it. <laughs> 37, 13. This is, this is a ballet pink. Don't you think it's a ballet? It looks, yeah, that's what it looks like. That's a ballet pink. And 790, 798. Which is a nice royal blue. I'm gonna put those in order. Only because, like I said, I'm anal that way. Another one, 782. Another rusty color. That's lighter than the other. 782. Come on, stay straight. Fly right. 938. Oh, 
have in here? They're all messed up. 938. All I think you missed up. 829. Did I show this to you already? That's a pretty that's a pretty chocolate one. This is actually it's a I think I think a name for this color. It's it's a yellowish brown. It's it's more yellow than it shows in the uh it's lighter than it shows in the camera. Why it doesn't show the right color? I don't know. Ooh, got a stray. So that's eight twenty nine, and now we got thirty seven oh six. Forget it. Uh, did I show you 996 and 3325? I hope I did. If I didn't, yeah, they are. Let me straighten these out a little bit because I want to make sure that when I load them back in. I've given up now on keeping them in numerical order, <laughs> as you can tell. I just want to keep them neat so I can put them back in. 3325, nice color. I love this apricot, a very pale apricot, 967. Isn't that nice? Yeah. I don't know why, the lighter colors should seem to show up with no problem. Maybe this is why I'm having problems. <laughs> it's sticking to the edge of the crinkly. Back. Okay, so 967. What do we got here? 761, another pale pink. Not quite a ballet pink, a little darker than that. Um, almost with a little orangey, just, you know, really pretty, really pretty. Yeah, it, for, the light colors seem to show up fine. What you see is the color it is. 817, another bright red. Is that brighter than uh, 6XX? No, it's darker. <laughs> but it's still bright. 3770. Last but not least. 3865. A beautiful cream color. That's a very light pale cream. Let's call it eggshell. <laughs> What's the difference? I don't know. But, you know. Um... Yeah, these are some pretty colors in here, and I'm, they're in baggies, which many, many people love because you can work right out of them. I don't. I work in, from Harbor Freight's containers, uh, so I will be emptying these into the, har the correct Harbor Freight. I will take this, I will cut it out, I will cut out the, uh, the symbols list here. Though I may reduce it a little bit, take it, make it a copy. Uh, then I'll use my Zylon sticker maker and put these stickers on my my um, containers. All right, let's take a break. I'm gonna put these back, and uh, we'll go over the canvas a little closer and see what we can see. I'll be right back. Well, we're back. Hi. <laughs> um, yeah, this, the canvas is very easy to read. And I must say, from past experience, Treasure Studio Arts round drills are pretty good. I'm hoping they fix up the square. They were just a little bit too tiny for the uh, for the, the the canvas, and they left rather foreseeable gaps. So it was very frustrating. But I'm, she knows about it. I will let her, you know, give her time.
to hopefully get it fixed. I mean, problems happen with every single company in the world. It doesn't matter whether you're selling diamond paintings or selling cover binders or selling um, clothing or appliances. Things happen. You, every once in a while, you get a dud. You know, you get drills that aren't right. You get a canvas that is all wrinkly. You know, it happens. It happens. The best thing you can do is inform the uh, business owner and let them take it from there. If they fix it, wonderful. You'll keep buying from them. If they don't fix it or tell you there's no problem, um, you just don't have to buy from them anymore. <laughs> it's as simple as that. Um, she made it right by giving, sending me a new canvas. You know, it's not square like I love, but it is one of my, it was in my wish list. I can't help it. I like Renee and I like flowers and I like, and she, this artist, who's this artist again? Uh, does it say? Let's see, yeah. Deborah Dixon. Wildflowers by Deborah Dixon. This is very much in the um, style of Monet. Beautiful. Very beautiful. Like I said, it's sticky. It's very easy to read. I do not need a light pad to read this at all. Even the light, the, the, the white on the dark, nothing. Everything is very clear. Yeah, it's very easy to read. Nice canvas. Sturdy. It's not a soft lid, but that's okay. I like it. To me, once it's, once it's covered with diamond drills, it doesn't matter with salt flint or otherwise. Um, if you're going to hang it up, you're hanging it up flat. Nobody's going to see what the lid, you know, what the backing is. So, um, yeah, I am, I'm happy with this. I'm very happy. I got, I got my, uh, my pretty drills and my pretty painting. I'm very happy. <laughs> yeah. But um, I'm going to say uh, that that's it for now. I, I can't think of anything else to say to you. I mean, you know, that's why I don't do a lot of whipping chats because I just, I, I am fumble-minded. <laughs> you know how you're all thumbs and you can't type? I'm all mouth and I get tongue and I can't talk. I get tongue tied. Um, yeah, uh, I want to remind you that this is January 28th, 2022. We are having the uh, Ticket to Ride Destination Paris event uh, hosted by Crafting Journey and Cheryl Katz. We are also having the Blinging in the New Year hosted by DP Addiction Adventures and Tia's Crazy Crafts. I think that's it. DP Crafts. T is crazy. DP Crafts. Yeah. Um, and the, you can find them on Instagram and uh, Ticket to Rides on Facebook and everything else. I, I'm helping them because they're my friends. So, might as well. If, you, if it's past, you know, if it's past the new year and you're watching this, go take a look at some of the hashtag Ticket to Ride 2022 or the hashtag Bling it on. Uh, <clears throat> uh, yeah, or blinging in the new year, sorry. Take a look at some of those beautiful paintings that we're all having a blast doing. And yeah, blinging out. <laughs> and that's new for me. So uh, enjoy yourselves. Uh, be nice. Be good. Be happy. <laughs> Uh, wear your mask, do what you have to do to keep safe. Wear your mask, wash your hands, stay six feet away from people, uh, disinfect your countertops and door doorknobs. Don't forget the doorknobs. Like, you know, no, no. Uh, 
And the virus can last, I'm not sure how long it can last, but it can last on uh, things a, a little bit, you know, for a little bit. So you don't, you want to be safe. Um, and most of all, uh, like I said, be, do what you have to do to keep you and your family safe. And until the next time, I'm Evan Edgy.